Hello everyone and welcome to another Vital Bracelet video. In this video we're going to be taking a look at the new battle features in the VB app. So that's pretty exciting. Uh, you also notice that I am wearing just a tank top even though it's very cold and the reason for that is because, and if you haven't noticed, I have a green screen behind me and for some reason even though my hoodie is grey it kept on like kind of fizzing out a little bit and I'd rather just not be this, this floating head. I'd prefer to show the rest of me so you know that I do not just, I'm just not just a head basically. I'm not just a Futurama head in the jar. Anyway, so yes, green screen, that's exciting, testing it out. Um, so yeah, you can kind of see it if I wave my hands around, so that's kind of cool. But anyway, so let's take a quick, like, nine minute look at the battle functionality on the VB app. So this launched yesterday, so that's pretty exciting. And what we have here is we have the first option, which is the Diaboramon raid battle. And then we have various different options here. So we have the Omega Mon one, which signifies that this is any level. Any level can could participate in that rank in that uh, ranking battle. Then we've got with Pulse Mon signifies that we have the child level Digimon. So any child level Digimon can participate in that rank battle. And then we have Adult Perfect Mega, and then just a training battle, which doesn't affect any. There's no ranking. It's kind of like unranked. So these are all the arena battles, the training battle, and the raid battle. So what Digimon do I have active at the moment? Uh, none of them. So let's bring out... Uh, who do I want to bring out? Let's bring out All Force, because I do love my All Force. And uh, let's do some ranked battles, and then do some raid battling. So uh, the cool thing about these battles is that it actually increases uh, your vitals or obviously decreases if you lose it. So it's the same as the battles in the actual VB itself. So let's do Mega Arena Battle and let's fight against this person called Ben who has a Blitz Greymon. So the cool thing is this is all, these are all real people. So once you download the update for this version, so if you are not in Japan you use KuWap Ku or if you're on iPhone, I think that's just the iTunes store, and you just update it, and what it should, what, when you first up update it, it will give you a few different options. You will need to read the privacy policy and agree to it, and then do the same with the terms and conditions, which is fairly straightforward. You click on the privacy policy, which is the big button in the middle, and then you scroll down, and then you close, and then you can click the accept button, which I believe is the blue one. So it's pretty straightforward. I believe it's the same as if when you first downloaded the app. I believe it was the same sort of deal with the privacy policy. So we have one against uh, Ben's Blitz Greymon. So yeah, the cool thing is these are all like other people that you are fighting. Uh, it's not live, I don't think, but you are fighting against them. And then your rank goes up. So you can see that I went from 4,817th place to 3,329th place. And you also get rewards for winning. So you get experience points and you get these little items which are more or less like, I guess, nuggets in Pokemon. They just don't have any use. You can just sell them for coins in this. So that's pretty cool. So now that my rank's gone up, you can see that at the top there and how many points I have in the arena as well as how many times I've battled and my win-loss ratio. So what we can also do is we can fight in a raid battle, which we'll start the battle and we'll click yes. And this sort of levels up. So at the moment I'm rank 5 for this and then it goes up to rank 6 if I beat rank 5. So it's just Diaboromon at the moment. I believe that it's, it's sort of on a rotation and Diaboromon's the first one. So I dodged the first attack and I attacked. And I'm not sure if it was obvious from my first battle against uh, Ben's Blitz Greymon, is that you have to fill up this gauge, and if you oh, uh, that if you don't suck, uh, you can have it filled up, and then you'll do a critical attack. Like that. So, which is basically the same as your super powered attack in the VB itself, and it'll do more damage because it's the critical. And then you suck again, so it's fine. I've got really bad timing. 
but I still hit it, so that's fine. But I still lose because I didn't do enough damage in the in those turns. The cool thing is that while you are fighting the raid boss, you'll sometimes get support from other people who are also fighting the raid boss, and they'll all attack at once, and you'll sort of do more damage that way. So I was playing a little bit with this last night, and I basically had that once per battle with Diaboromon, basically. So that was kind of cool. But apparently not this morning. Maybe it's because I keep on missing them. Oh, but the damage that you've uh, that I've done to Diaboromon remains, so that's good at least. Ah, there's a support attack with one other Omegamon. So last night when I was battling, it was like many other Digimon. Like, it was like ten Digimon at once. It was pretty cool. I really love the sprites and the whole... Uh, I, I love the amount of work... That, there's two Digimon who are helping me out now. I just love the amount of work that's gone into this. Like, I love the little animations. I just I just feel like it's really cute. And it's just it's just really exciting. I don't know why. I was kind of surprised when the PvP and raid boss... Uh, update actually came because I was like, oh, for some reason I thought it was going to take longer, but that's super exciting that it uh, it dropped yesterday. So yeah, so that's basically it. As I mentioned, you can go against like just anyone in training, and it doesn't have a ranking, so it's like you just battle really. So we could battle against Hariru, who has a Gabumon, which would not be a good matchup. I've got an all force against Gabumon, but my timing does suck. See, it sucks. And with this update, there's also a few additional items that you can buy in the shop, which are power-ups. I'm I haven't actually used any of them yet, but there's like attack power-ups and defense power-ups, and those are for, for use in the arena mode. So yeah, well, let's do a uh, the free-for-all one. And let's fight against who should we fight against? Ah, uh, Namakemon. I love Namakemon. I love his name. I, sh I should raise a Namakemon. Uh, let's fight against Valvemon. I go between calling Valvemon Valvemon and Valvemon Bulbmon because I'm fairly certain he was called Bulbmon in the in the Digimon World 2003 game. Also, I wish you could see my tank top because I got it from Redbubble from on me uh, me on on. Omni Yayo, I think it is. I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong, but that's a uh, really cool artist who has recently started on Redbubble and has an Edremont shirt. There we are, you can see it, yay! Uh, so, of course, I had to get that. And uh, yeah, I've been kind of wearing it a lot, but obviously, because it's cold, I wear my hoodie. Except not today, because I don't want to be a floating head. So, yeah, I want to get Svelmon here. And my ranking for the all level. Battle went up, and I got more experience points. So I can sell those items and basically get more V coins to buy missions with, or to buy, um, I forgot what they were called those the plugins, the buffs for the battle. And as you can see, I need to actually buy the pro version of this app because it only lasts for ten minutes. But that bet was basically done showing off the functionality anyway. I should go and buy this this app because it'll give me more than 10 minutes. So that'd be cool if I do want to make the longer videos. So yep, that was pretty cool. And basically, thanks for watching. And I hope that the green screen was okay. I wanted, I've been wanting to green screen for a while, but I was like, oh, I'm not sure about it. I've done a bit of upgrading on my setup since I moved, which is exciting. And we finally got blinds put in yesterday. So that's doubly exciting. Hopefully it's better for the acoustics and the lighting. I've also got a light behind the webcam here. Oh, you can see my hair starting to disappear. Don't know where it's picking up the green from my hair, but there we go. So anyway, that was pretty exciting. And thanks for joining me and exploring the battle functionality of the VB app. So thanks for watching and I will see you on the next video. Bye!